Have you ever tried to upload a file only to discover that it's not the correct file type or size? Trust me, I've been there. But thankfully, today I will show you how to convert your video files into other formats like GIFs, images, and MP3s, as well as how to compress and reduce your file size. So click the link in the description below and follow along because the first thing you're going to need to do is upload your files. When you click on the link in the bio, you will be taken to Kapwing. Then click here, and now you can either upload from your device or from a URL link. Kapwing is a full studio editor, so you can edit and customize things now if you want. You can add text or subtitles, etc. But if your video is exactly the way you want it, now you're going to convert your video. Go to the top right hand corner of the editor where you will see export project. Under format, you will see these options to change the file type. MP4 is a typical video file. Some websites only take GIF files, so you might want to change your animations to that. And of course, MP3 is for audio files. In case you are, let's say, converting a video into a podcast episode. If you choose any of these formats, you can press export at the bottom and it will start exporting in the background. If you want to take a still from a video and turn it into a PNG, however, that button will turn into select an image frame. And when you click it, you can choose what image you want to export and then click export image. When exporting is done, all of your newly formatted files will appear in recent exports. Click download to download your files straight to your device. Now, let's say you have the right file type, but you want to make the video smaller. Smaller files can sometimes help web pages perform better. Social media platforms sometimes have a size limit you can hit. And also, it's just nice to have small file sizes when storing videos on your computer. So it is time to compress your file. Head to the Export Project button again in the top right hand corner. From there, find Estimated File Size towards the bottom of the options. If you have an exact size range you're looking to hit, this is what you're going to want to keep your eye on. Right above that, you will see compression level, where you can adjust the file size without changing the resolution, and you will immediately see the estimated file size change below. If for some reason you need an extremely small file, you can always end up changing the resolution in the options above, although that will affect the quality a little bit, and for most instances, the compression level bar will work and should be your first plan. Once you find the setting that matches the size you need, press export. When exporting is done, your compressed files will appear in recent exports. From there, click download to download files straight to your device. And that's it. While your video is exporting and downloading, make sure you check out all the other incredible tools Kapoing has to offer. It can totally transform your team's workflow and make video creation a breeze. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tips on how to level up your content and happy editing.